And it seems to me the, the most uh, uh, difficult challenge for uh, not just global legal education, but legal education generally is, is one of relevance. Um, because law faculties, uh, law schools are torn in plurality of directions now. They're uh, trying to serve a number of constituencies and respond to market pressures and uh, address changing environments in the pol political and the economic uh, sphere. And it seems to me that puts a lot of pressure on what is relevant uh, in uh, legal education at every level, both at the local level, uh, at the global level, and I would add to this within the university setting as well, to make the law faculties and law schools uh, of continuous relevance to the life of the university and to, uh, to what uh, universities generally aspire to accomplish. Uh, and it seems to me the response to that challenge has to be that, uh, as, as I tried to articulate earlier uh, in, in the context of the seminar, the response has to be that each faculty or each law school needs to think itself about uh, how to become relevant in its own environment. I don't think there's a single model of what the global law school could be if there is a, an aspiration to, to, to do this. Uh, each faculty needs to make that transformation to respond to the environment uh, in which it finds itself in a way that is meaningful in its own context. Uh, and so m what, I've, w what I worry about, I think, one of the major challenges in terms of making sense of global ed legal education is the quick fix, which is to introduce a variety of legal perspectives, traditions as, as isolated morsels of, of uh, information or insight, divorced from their own setting unconnected to the traditions in which they emerge, unconnected to the political, cultural, and institutional environment in which they emerge. And to me, that's a mistake. There, there is a, a space out there of normativity which is transnational or truly global. It's not negligible, but it's not the only normative space uh, that should be of interest to law school. Law schools really have to think about, uh, again, being relevant not just within that fairly narrow sphere of, of uh, global transactions and global governance, uh, but also to be relevant in the very local uh, environment in which many of its graduates, uh, many of their graduates are going to, uh, to practice and serve the community. So I think that basically is the takeaway from this particular session. We've seen uh, four, five different responses to that uh, concern, which in many ways, I think, can be highlighted as closely connected to the political and uh, economic conditions in which these law schools operate, each in their own sphere.